Greetings and welcome to Factorio. I'm Digre and today we will continue with our Waptorio series. So from the look of this map or this world, it's going to be a resource collection one. So uh, let's just get started with it and let's do the same setup as we did before. A ton of burner mining drills collecting iron. Oh, that's correct. And then we can also actually put a few up that collects coal. So that's actually very nice. Don't think I can fit in any more than this. Maybe able to fit in one more. Uh, don't know if that is good. No. Right here. Let's just get three of them and get this up and running. Let's put in. I'll put down some. Uh, what's it called burners. And then, uh, yeah, let's get this show on the road. It's quite nice to having uh, even distribution in this case. <laughs> so things can just kind of get into a good rhythm. Um, before I forget, or oh, yeah, before I forget, let's get some turrets down. They are extremely important. And if you forget, we will most likely die. And look at this beautiful design. Let's give it, oh, not like that. Let's give it some ammo. And that should um, kind of protect our entire area like that. So, should we set up a few more? I think we should, because this, as I said, is a resource collection episode. Hopefully this means that we can put them all the way out here without any issues. And no bites in sight yet, so we might go exploring a bit and leave this to our defense. We might use a few, but I think it's worth it comparing to the amount of resources we're going to get. Um, I might be going back and forth, um, putting in the resource we need. And let's get some miner on this one as well. And get down a few more of these. And the rest are kind of just stuck in our base at the moment. And that is exactly where I want them. Uh, don't know if we need defense for these. Or we just live with us losing them. If, uh, if that happens. Could just give it one for defense. And surround it. And that might be good enough. There we are. And a bit of defense. So let's just uh, give this a bit of time to get into the groove of things. There we are. And then we could go explore a small amount. So we can see if we can find any biters that are in the way and need ex needs killing. Or we might be so lucky that we are completely free of biters. Nope, we have, uh, no, that's, well, that's not, that's just big worms, so that's fine. Nothing spawns from those. And what if we look over here? Hopefully nothing is here as well, because then we might be able to set up a bit of research as well. Maybe underground, and then get some power up in there. Um... I don't know if it's possible to get power underground yet. I think if you power this one, it uh, it is possible. So uh, let's go collect a bit of stone as well. I'll just take what I have in my storage down here. So let's get a few of... Well, that's not what I want. I kind of want to do that. Get a few of these. And get the stone from over here. Can't remember if I had any. What's it called? Fuel on me, but I can always just take a bit of wood. And then we are actually looking very good on this uh, this world. Seems very good in terms of uh, of biters. So you might be able to get quite oh. I say that as I get attacked, so it bites us out to the north. That would most definitely be a place I go and check out right away. 
Let's bring a bit of uh, things with us. We have some ammo. We have some armor. Have a few turrets. Might not be enough. But let's go and check where we have the biters. And hopefully the rest can uh, take care of itself for a few minutes. So where are the biters at? Since they are attacking us, they must be somewhere. Oh, 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 I'm stuck in the forest. I have to get out of here. So, um, yeah, we might not be able to stay here as long as I want. But at least this should be... Def wow, they are fast. So this should be able to defend it at least. So, uh, oh, that's a lot of biters. Let's get down some more defense right here and let's start to craft a lot more ammo. There we are. And the rest should be fine. And then we can just leave this as our point defense. And hopefully they won't reach down here. That is the plan. Um, everything is missing fuel. That's because these are some hungry hunger things. That might also be why we have so many things attacking us. We just got more than a thousand iron. We have nothing down here producing at the moment. So uh, we're actually lacking quite a bit of coal in this one. That is a bit of an issue. But it should be fine. These will just keep us defended. But let's go in here and grab some coal. We should have quite a bit stored up. Dump in some iron. Keep a bit on us as well. Oh, we have a ton of coal in these, so that is fine. This is, this is working fine. Oh, yeah. So everything's looking very good. We have a nice big production plant. A power plant down here. Also known as a smeltery. <laughs> power plant. Wow. There we are. You can just keep going, producing a ton of copper for us. Oh, they're coming from the south as well. That is a bit of an issue. So uh, we might have overextended a bit with this amount being produced. But uh, it should be fine. There we are. This one can still keep them out. So... Uh, we will just keep going as we have so far. Uh, we are killing a ton of biters everywhere. They are getting quite cheeky. And that projectile upgrade might be very good when we go to uh, to the next area. Let's throw in some copper here as well. Just so we have a bit of storage. We might actually switch this up to... Um, What's it called? Electric mining drills instead. I think they'll concentrate um, the attacks. What's it called? On um, our main base. Or where we have our... What's it called? Steam production. And I think that could be a good way to uh, limit where they attack. Because look at that. We are burning for coal at an alarming rate. So that might actually be the way to do it. And we are collecting... Co oh, and we are attracting quite a few uh, <laughs> of the indigenous species. They are not happy with what we are doing at the moment. So we might pull up a few of these just because uh, it will take a while to do it later on. And they are getting... Oh, they are killing our uh, stone. That is fine. I'll just give that to the biters. That is not too bad. That's fine. So let's start to pick up a bit of this. Just so we can... Uh, buy by some stuff as a stone in the chest. So, okay. We will have to leave very soon, guys. <laughs> I might have overextended quite a bit in terms of uh, what our base can handle. 
How is it looking right here? Can this keep up? It still can, but it's running out of ammo quite, quite fast. So uh, these are consuming. There's not really that much left. And they are getting closer and closer to us. So moving out in just a few minutes might be very good. We have collected a ton of resources. Let's just pick up the rest. Hopefully I have enough room for it. I do. And then let's go back to our base and walk to the next world. Unless this leaving might, it might be a mistake leaving this early, but I think it'll be fine because uh, it is starting to cost quite a bit in terms of resourcing, spending all these bullets. Come on, and okay, more and more uh, attacking. Let's get ready to warp. Yep, that seems like a very, very good solution. Oh, let's go outside again. There we are. How much ammo do we have left? Quite a bit, but most definitely not enough. Ooh, okay, thank God we're warping away. This... Oh, I could have gotten the stone. But we're warping five seconds and I don't want to get left behind. Bye-bye. Okay, new planets. Let's do a bit of research. Uh, first things first, I might set it up down here. Um, or there's a lab production. And hopefully we can get uh, power in. Let's just do it in an ugly setup. We can actually do it something like this for now. We have a few inserters to help us out. A few power poles. Should have done this in the other map. Hopefully, oh, this seems like this will work. So let's give ourselves some red science, red science and some gears. Here you are and there and there. So this should work as soon as we activate some power up here. And that means we just have to defend this area from whatever biotis gets here. And that should not be that big of a deal. Which is also famous last words. <laughs> So uh, let's see if we have enough power to uh, to do this. Uh, I don't know if we need two or one, but for now we'll just do this and some defense around them. There we are. Here is some ammo for you. Here is some fuel for you and drag you back to the base. So hopefully that means science has started down here. We of course need a few more of these. Please stop so we can get these into that one and that one. And we have our first automated production below ground. Science is going to be built. It's going to be moved around. And uh, yeah, let's throw in some of this as well. Don't know if uh, that was the correct way to do it, but that is the way we're doing it right now. So that is working. Let's go collect some resources around the map. And this should defend more than enough. Um, do we have any resources on this map? It doesn't look like it yet. How's the pollution looking? Spreading quite quickly. Uh, nothing over here, it looks like. Let's just leave that. But it was a coal, coal patch up here, and I might want to take advantage of that. Uh, to grab some coal for the future. Could just set some miners down and get some defense around it right away. So let's just do this.
Hopefully this will, uh, will start itself somehow. There we are, and then we can pick up all of these again. Please give me all that coal and get down a small amount of defense. And let's collect a ton of coal this time. And some ammo. There we go. That should defend itself, hopefully. And let's just have a look up here. Um, these should be working. No biters in sight. And doesn't look like they're anywhere close by at the moment. Ooh, this might be very good in terms of research. Uh, any goods? Oh, we've got some stone we can take right here. Has a bit of coal. There's some copper. Might leave that alone for now. And let's just craft some more ammo while we're moving. Oh, we have oh we have stone down here. That's quite good. Um, should we take it in case we might be provoking the biters? This is actually a better area in terms of defense than up north. Oh, are we on an island? That would be so good if we were. Oh, is it closed off? Oh, yes, guys. This is very, very good. This might be just what we need. We might be able to steal a lot more iron from here. At a cost of minimal defense. But yeah, Biotis is still attacking. But we are defending it, so that should be fine. Um... Don't know if this is a good or bad idea, what I'm doing right now, but uh, let's give it a try. And please give this some fuel. There we are. And a bit of defense. Hopefully I'm not uh, spreading myself out too thin. Because I am getting a bit... I was about to say cocky, and that might not be a bad thing to call it. Because I am thinking that I can easily survive this. That is not a good mindset to be in. So leave that. I'll keep running. And over here, things are going fine. We are producing steam. These are defending us very nice. So uh, let's just plop in some more coal this can easily defend us so that's fine and how's it looking down here uh, it's working as fast as it can might get a few more because we definitely need the science to be up and running uh, that is fine so let's go grab a bit of coal before it jams up could probably move all of this down south, but uh, for now it's fine up here. Doesn't look like we have any biters attacking us anytime soon. And that just gave us a whole ton of coal. Which is going to be very, very useful for the future. So, uh, oh, they're coming from the north as well now. Hmm. Might have overextended a bit with the... Uh, with that but hopefully we'll get our projectile damage up and running very soon let's get a few more of these let's get this down let's get a few of these here here please research <laughs> look at this mess seems to be working how's it looking out here very good and we are producing quite a bit of iron that is good. Good. Oh, thank God we have defense everywhere. And we should be able to move it quite easily. There we are. Let's just pick up a bit of things here and there. But if we have too many places to defend, we'll spend more and more ammo, and that will tax our iron research quite uh, iron resources quite a bit. 
And it seems I might be able to have to get some copper. How much do we have in storage? Oh. oh, we still have a bit, but not a lot. So, um, might go up and pick up our coal from up top. Oh, they're getting stronger. That is actually starting to be an issue. So I'm quite glad we're getting uh, bullet damage up and running. So let's collect this. I don't think we need any more for the foreseeable future. And agitating the biases anymore might not be what we need at the moment. So let's see here. Yeah, you can just attack me. I have defense here, so save me. So this kind of fort turret defense seems to be holding off the biases quite well. Of course, don't pick it up too soon. So remember to kill the biases attacking you. Then you pick it up and then you run for your life. And go. <laughs> because if you get... Uh, if they catch up to you, you are most certainly going to feel it. And it's not nice. So uh, down here, everything is still looking good. Should be producing a lot less pollution now. These are still going. Killed 121. And down here we have a bit more. Here is some labs. We can just do... What a spaghetti mess. Please research for days. Oh, we got the bullet damage. That should mean that we are going to kill them a bit faster now. Flow, we don't need that yet. I think we have enough energy flowing in at the moment. We don't have enough energy flowing in at the moment. Might have. So let's see here. The next thing we should get should probably be this one because that unlocks a lot of things down here could also get this one that's not needed uh, this could be good as well it's quite easy to get out of the way and that gives us belts Recharge faster, but unlocks a ton of things, including more damage, but more damage is extremely expensive. What about that one? That is locked behind electronics, so we might actually just get this one first. And steel afterwards. And that'll give us better armor as well. But I need steel. Uh steel axe that one we want so let's go for that one i think faster mining speed will be very very useful and this should be researching quite fast uh, we have 10 minutes left um these holding fine that is holding fine as well and so is it down here so let's just go collect the iron seems we are missing quite a bit of fuel down here might set up a few to oh that's a lot of biotas attacking but with increased damage that should not matter too much please let's go all of it always but look at that oh that's a lot attacking that's a lot lot attacking so uh we will probably have to leave very soon. What do you guys think? Can we survive this for a few more minutes? Oh, oh I have to figure out how to do that entrance a bit better. Uh, let's do that. There we are. That's 100 everywhere. So, uh, not too bad, not too bad. Let's set up a small amount of copper collection I think six might be fine just to get a small amount up and running there we are and is there any coal nearby in rocks there's some out here might just go out and collect some 
while we wait for things to be researched. Oh, it seems we ran out of uh, of science inside, and that is actually a bit bad. Not bad, bad, but uh, it's just us missing uh, copper, I think. Uh, and this sword is strong. They are killing quite a lot. How's the power holding? We are at 21. That is also fine. Need to get some ammo over here, though. Look at that mess. There we are. Here's some fuel for you. And you can just die. And down here we're missing... Oh, iron. Sorry. Forgot the iron for these. So let's just do our small chest. No, it might be stupid to spend an entire iron chest on that. But I think it'll be good for the future. Here, there, and put in some iron. So that should get our science up and running again. Whoa. <laughs> oh, snap. Yeah, let's go pick up iron miners. I think it's about time we leave this area. Oh, I hope I haven't overextended myself. Snap, 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 snap. <laughs> Come here. This can only go to slow. I'm very much looking forward to getting the new pickaxe so we can mine twice as fast. Come on. Pick it all up, please. Oh, snap. Look on the map. That is not good. Not good at all. Come on. Oh, now we have things attack from here as well. So, uh, I know it's just one, but that's just a preemptive force. I know how they think. Holy moly, we out of ammo in some of these. Out of ammo a lot of places over here, so... Uh, let's throw some in. Oh, snap. Stop, stop. There we are. Let's pick up all of this. I think it's about time we leave. Can we start the warp? Yep. We now have 30 seconds onto the warp. And I'll also... Ooh, snap! Oh! <laughs> okay, let's get a pulse. No, I leave the list. Oh! <laughs> okay. Okay, guys. Okay, guys. Shit! <laughs> Okay, we have to get out of here. Come on, eight seconds. <laughs> oh god, that was so close. Whew. So, yeah. I <laughs> will end the episode here. That was... Uh, I was starting to get a bit hairy. I didn't want to uh, leave that for another few minutes. But uh, <laughs> hopefully you're enjoying this as much as I am. This is uh, more fun than I had in a while. I don't know why this uh, pressure is uh, it's making me get, uh, giddy so much, I think. But uh, I think it's quite good. So uh, hopefully you will like and subscribe and hit that bell button. Because uh, I feel like this is a series that's going to be, uh, be so good. It's been so good so far, so uh, it's going to be even better in the future. So... Thank you so much for watching, guys. I've been Degray, and I'll see you next episode. Bye.